Hey guys, welcome to Zara Zoo. I'm Zara and thanks so much for stopping by. So I'm recovering from a cold that I got on the weekend. Um, my voice is kind of like messed up. So sorry if it kind of goes like in and out, like just like drops and stuff. Cause my voice says like weird things when it's like getting lost. So um, for, as you can tell from the title of this video, I'm going to be unboxing my hamster meal. And this is what this, this is what this month's package looks like. And funny story, well not only funny, it's kind of annoying. So last month, I videoed my unboxing, I like took everything out, went over all the products, had videos of my hamsters enjoying everything, and then, I don't know, I was leaving some old stuff on my phone the day after, so I might have deleted everything and everything was lost. And then the month before that, same thing happened, so now I'm finally making a hamster meal unboxing after like the third attempt, so hopefully this doesn't get deleted and it works out. So, I'm gonna grab some scissors and let's get started. Personal information is gonna be exposed. Ugh. Very nice scissors are like metal cutting scissors. Okay, I got it. But pretty much the most so pretty much most of the hamster meal boxes are in this kind of shaped box. It's like flat and like a rectangle shape. Um, but my first or second hamster meal box was kind of more like a bigger, like weird rectangle shape because I don't have a bigger toy in it. So I guess most of them are like this size, but an occasional toy might be big, so they might change the box layout, but Pretty much, it looks like this. Um, and then when you open it up, it has the beautiful yellow tissue paper. So let's do that. <coughs> Ooh. So, mm, sorry guys. The first thing I always see is this Hip Hip Hooray. You've got hamster meal. So this is what comes in it. And on the back, it pretty much notes the two toys um, and the two treats that you're given and then information about that. It also mentions the charity of the month, which is Wood Green. And it, Wood Green is a charity that provides care for animals all over the UK. So one thing that I really like about this um, subscription box is that they do give back to different charities. I think that's really important. Um, and I really like the fact that the treats that they give you are all usually all natural and like they're healthy treats and not kind of like sugary treats. That's also a great bonus. And from my experience of like, what, like my three or four, this is my fourth box or fifth box, I believe. Everything in here is stuff that they can't get at Petco or PetSmart. My hamsters really seem to like everything that they get, so I can't wait to show you guys what's inside. So the first thing I want to show you is this treat, and it's called the Summer Mocktail, a complete, a complimentary feed for hamsters by the Healthy Hopper brand. And I really love getting these Healthy Hopper um, treats. Last month, I think it was like dandelion and little like pieces in a baggie. Um, and my hamsters always go crazy for whatever this brand has. Everything seems really natural, it's dehydrated. And um, I know that when I give it to my hamsters, even if I give like, a little extra pinch, they're not gonna like, it's not gonna make them sick. It doesn't have extra sugar, it's healthy. So um, I've really been loving anything from the Healthy Hopper and my hamsters have been loving everything from the Healthy Hopper. So that's like an extra bonus. And like, look how cute this is. It's really cute. And it says um, all the ingredients on the back. Sorry, see, I'm really weird, I'm so sick. I'm still getting over my cold, but like, yeah. So, so the next sheet that I got, I just wanna like make a shout out to like the hamster um, subscription box just because they wrapped my treats up and in the past with Rosewood products I got from BioVet, they just like tossed them in the box. There was no bubble wrap, there was no like extra care. So when I got these, I was like, yes, they're not crushed. Everything's intact. These are the Rosewood dandelion sticks and, um, oh, my voice. Um, pretty much they're made with cereal, seeds, vegetables, herbs, nuts, eggs, and um, egg products. So um, I wouldn't just give my hamster this whole thing. I usually just break it off into little bits and pieces. Um, and then I kind of give it to my hamsters like kind of every now and then as a treat. So I think they're really going to like this. I have tried other rows of natural like stick things and they go crazy for them. So I know this will be a great hit. So that's the second treat. And then... The first toy that I see is this, these tricksy little like apple looking things. I can't pronounce that word, so like, that's for you guys. Um, my hamsters aren't only really a big fan of these little, like this fabric type of like toy, but um, I have a hedgehog and he loves to like kind of take these toys and toss them around, so I might just give them to him. And it's a bonus if you guys have extra small um, animals because you can always give them to your other pets or if a friend has a pet that they might enjoy, you can always give it to them. 
then the last um, toy that was in the box is this Trixie Bendy Bridge. And if you're a hamster owner or if you have a hamster, this is like a given. Like everyone like I know has these little Bendy Bridges. They come in so handy. You can do so many things with them. You can put like your food dish on here. You can like bend it into like a little hide. You can like use it as like a level. I have a bunch of these. I can never like have enough, especially when I get into my, well I have two hamsters, so I kind of split them between the two hamsters. And then I also have a hedgehog, so sometimes I'll give it to my hedgehog, even my reptiles. Like sometimes you like to use these little bendy bridges to hide under and like climb on. So um, they are very like versatile and, ugh, gosh, I sound like that. Um, it's just like, I love this product. And I feel like the products that they give you normally, it's like something that like, there's always one thing that your hamster is gonna like. So I've really big up, I've really been a big fan of the hamster meal subscription boxes. So if you haven't already, maybe try giving them, just try giving them a chance. I really, I haven't been disappointed. Everything, every single product I've gotten, at least two out of the four products my hamster likes, or at least if I don't have the hamster that likes it, I have to like other pet that. Oh, sorry, that sounds gross. So, yeah, everything has been really successful with the hamster roll boxes. All my pets have loved them. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below if you have tried the hamster mail subscription box and if your hamsters have liked these items or if your hamsters would like these items. I think they're really awesome. I don't have products like these where I live. There are some similar things with the toys, but treat-wise, I can't get these at PetSmart. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye.